Welcome back, my name is Kenneth Brooks and today we've got a very special video because I'm going to be showing my brand new haul. I've got loads of retired sets and I'm also going to be showing all of my sealed collection. So all of the new sets I've got for my haul are sealed and I'm also going to show some of my sealed sets up there at the end of the video. So here is the main bulk of the haul. It is absolutely insane. This is the biggest haul I've ever got. Let's check it out. But first I'll tell you how I got the haul. My parents have been saving up all of these sets from back to about 2011, because some of those Pirates of the Caribbean sets are that old, and they've been saving up to give them to me recently. So just as a quick overview, I have a few DC sets down there. These are the Hobbit sets and the Lord of the Rings sets. A load of Harry Potter sets there, and some Pirates of the Caribbean sets. And I also have a few random themed sets here. So starting off with the DC sets, we have Superman and Crypto Team Up, which is a cool set. We also have the Wonder Woman 84 set. We've got the Batman, Batwing, and the Riddler Heist. This awesome Two-Face set from the Batman movie. And of course the classic TV series, Batcave. Next up, let's take a look at the Hobbit sets. So we have two of these Mirkwood Spider Escape sets. And here is the other one. I've already built one, which is pretty cool. And then we have the Witch King Battle, pretty nice. Dolgoldur Ambush, Mirkwood Elf Army, Attack on Lake Town. And we ha also have another Attack on Lake Town, so two of those sets. Here is the Attack on the Wargs set. The Battle of the Five Armies, Barrel Escape, Dol Guldur Battle, the larger Lake Town set, the Goblin King Battle, the Hobbit Hole, and the largest Hobbit set, the Lonely Mountain. So that is pretty much every single Hobbit set which I did not have already. Next up we've got Lord of the Rings. We have one uruk Army set. I've already got another one which I built downstairs. I also got three Orc Forges. The Council of Elrond, Shelob's Attack, The Battle at the Black Gate, The Attack on Weathertop, The Mines of Moria, The Pirate Ship Attack, The Battle of Helm's Deep, and The Tower of Warthank, which I've had sealed already. Next up, let's take a look at the Harry Potter sets. First up, I've got every single Hogwarts book set. These two Fantastic Beasts sets. Here is a load of smaller Hogwarts edition sets. The Beau Baton's Carriage, Hagrid and Buckbeak, The Monster Book of Monsters, The Shrieking Shack and The Whomping Willow, Hagrid's Hut, The Burrow, The Room of Requirement, The Hogwarts Express, Hogsmeade Village, Hogwarts Chamber of Secrets, The Ministry of Magic, Twelve Grimold Place, and The Awesome Diagon Alley. Now it's on to the Pirates of the Caribbean. The Captain's Cabin, a few cool smaller sets. The Mill. White Cat Bay. Unfortunately, it's got some box damage, but that does not matter because I will build it eventually. The Black Pearl. Queen Anne's Revenge. And the Silent Mary. Let's take a look at a few more sealed sets that I have. This trophy. Four Creator 3-in-1 Sharks. The Small Adidas Shoe. The Lego Ideas Sailboat Adventure. Two 332nd Ahsoka's Clone Trooper Battle Packs. The Big Yellow Lego Lorry. The Creator 3 in 1 Noodle Shop. And the Spider Man Bridge Battle. I've also got this Mr. Freeze poly bag. Here are some more poly bags. Now let's go back into the Lego room and I'll show you the sealed sets that I have in there. So there's my sealed collection in the Lego room. I'm not going to show each set individually because it will probably take ages as well, but I'll show some highlights. So you can see some Star Wars Battle Packs. Most of these are gift with purchases, as you can see. And then we have the two Friends television series sets. An Ninjago set, Lone Ranger set, DC Superhero set. And then inside of the big Lego head, a load more poly bags. As you can see, we have also built some of the Hobbit and Lord of the Rings sets. You can see one of the Orc Forges and one of the Helm's Deep sets here with the Uruk High Army. And a load of different Hobbit sets dotted around as well. The minifigures in these sets are absolutely awesome and I can't wait to make a proper layout for both of the film trilogies. 
We also recently built the sailboat and put it next to the fishing shack. And this is definitely a great set. So there will be lots of future developments happening in the Lego room to fit all of these new sets in. So make sure you subscribe and put notifications on so you don't miss out on any updates from me. And I also want to know in the comments which one of these sealed sets is your favourite. See you in the next one.